I finished my uh, residency in 2000, and since I've come to Urology Centers of Alabama, I um, have really concentrated more on female urology. I see uh, predominantly women. I also see men, but I see a lot of women, and I really enjoy uh, studying and uh, operating female pelvic floor dysfunction, uh, uh, urinary incontinence, um, prolapse, cysticeles, rectocele, vaginal prolapse. I have tried to incorporate um, not only surgery but also uh, non-surgical um, methods into my practice. Um, I see men. I love to see uh, all types of urological problems, but I have concentrated lately on more female type problems. Another thing that I've done at Urology Centers of Alabama is I've concentrated on um, uh, developing new techniques to, uh, to help, with, uh, uh, help with urinary incontinence, help with pelvic floor prolapse. And in the last few years, I've really concentrated on the robotic repair of, uh, of vaginal prolapse, uh, what, you know, what you may call fallen bladders, fallen vaginas. Um, and this is a newer technique uh, that's uh, less invasive that'll help women with uh, support of these organs. Um, I'm, I believe I'm one of, of a few urologists in the state of Alabama. I think I'm the only woman who does the robotic repair of vaginal prolapse. Uh, when I don't practice medicine, I'm, I'm really an outdoorsy type person. I like to hike. I like to uh, do anything that involves the outdoors. In the winter we ski, we like to go skiing, just like to be outdoors working in the garden. I have three young kids and they keep me really busy so I'm heading off to each one's soccer games and uh, da uh, ballet and so it's, it's, it's busy and then a husband who works so um, it's, it's, it's a lot going on right now but I, I just enjoy it. It just, it just somehow it fits together. I don't know how but it does. Say something. We uh, came from India, Bombay, India. And I came with my mom and dad and my younger sister. Um, we lived in a small apartment in Maryland. My parents both had two jobs. Um, and, you know, just came to the country, worked real hard. My parents were both naturalized in 1978, so we became citizens at that point. And I since had an, a younger sister also, so there's three girls. Um, went, did all my schooling in the United States, actually moved to Virginia, uh, got into the University of Virginia and actually went to medical school there. Um, and that's where I decided, you know, that's why I really wanted to do urology. Um, and it's kind of interesting because my younger sister also went to Virginia and she ended up being a urologist too, so I, I don't know. Nobody else in my family is a physician, but I thought that was kind of neat. Yeah. My husband's a physician also. He um, has a very busy practice. He's in academic medicine. And so we're, it's, it's somewhat of a balance, although I don't know if we've ever reached that balance, but somehow we try to work, you know, work it out. Um, and you know, we just like it. I enjoy living in Birmingham. It's a, it's a great town, and there's a lot of support from our friends and our neighbors. My favorite part of urology is really the people, the patients. I, I think at Urology Centers of Alabama, we have a great office. I, I, I enjoy working. Um, you know, there's not a day that goes by that I say, gosh, I wish I didn't have to work. I, I really like coming to work. I love seeing the patients um, and just getting to know them because some of them I feel like they've, you know, they've been with me through having kids and uh, they've known me for a long time. They know my husband. They, you know, they just know a lot about me and I feel that you develop a relationship with your patients and that's the way it should be.